Hey, thanks for the opportunity to talk about circle singing and vocal improvisation. Uh, my connection to circle singing began when I was a student at Mills College in Oakland, California. I was getting a degree in music with a specialization in vocal performance. And one of my wonderful teachers there was Molly Holm. And she was one of the original members of Bobby McFerrin's Voice Astra. Now we're super blessed here in the Bay Area because we have access to about 80% of Bobby McFerrin's original Voice Astra either to study with, watch them perform, watch them facilitate um, in different environments. Um, so I allowed myself to get infused for years and years. Um, in 2011, I took a little bit of a leap uh, and decided to go ahead and start facilitating. And I started a class in Marin and I was there for about a year, then moved over to Berkeley. Um, and I founded Bay Area Vocal Improvisation and Community Music. Um, my class is a little bit more of a exploration and allowing folks to find their own voice and making up music together. However, circle singing is part of that as well. If you'd like some more information, my website is www.bayareavocalimprov.com. This practice, for me, whether I'm practicing my own facilitation skills or I'm a participant in a circle with somebody else, or I'm actually facilitating, is always, always, always healing. There's something about sitting in a non-hierarchical circle with people, looking into their eyes, feeling them, feeling their joy, feeling their vulnerability, maybe feeling their angst, you know, whatever might be present that day. That is such a healing modality for us today because we spend so much time with technology out of necessity. That's where everything is now. If we work um, and if we want to communicate with others, it's an expectation. And yet it has become an expectation of how we will connect with others. And yet that has quickly been proven to become an illusion. Because real connection happens when I'm looking at you in your eyes and sharing my feelings of appreciation, my feelings of support, of lifting you up, and of you sharing yours with me. And in the circle singing, context we get to do that we get to increase our serotonin we get to breathe we get to stand up a little taller we get to move there is no activity that lights up more parts of the brain than making music it has actually been scientifically proven and so everything is online in this somatic system when we're singing together uh, so I encourage you wherever you are, to look up circle singing in your community and make a connection. Uh, your heart and your spirit and your body will, will thank you.